What's up gentlemen? So today a little Alpha M field trip. We're in Chicago walking down Oak Street. Why are we here? It's pretty simple. It was in this city on this street when I passed this store and read that sign. And it was this word that inspired these shades. Come on, let's go inside. Michael. Zach, what's up, baby? What's up, baby? How are you? Looking good. Today, guys, we're in Glasses Limited, the hot place to buy incredibly premium glasses, sunglasses, and everything I wear. Zach, who have some of your more prestigious clients been? I'm talking. Keanu Reeves. Keanu? Keanu. He's so hot right now. He's hot right now. What about that other certain sassy senorita from Chicago? Yeah, I don't know if you guys have heard of Oprah Winfrey. Oprah comes and shops for Zach. And when, when she comes, you like shut the store down. Oh yeah, you have to. It's Oprah. <laughs> and who else? A uh, guy by the name of Johnny Depp. Johnny, Johnny Depp. Does it get any cooler John, than Johnny Depp? John Cusack. Q you kidding me? Robert Mark. Bottle green lenses. Ooh, what do you think, guys? Non-polarized. You don't need to polarize. You don't need polarized. Don't need talk polarized. to the gentleman about polarization. It's, it's unnecessary, okay? I mean, unless you're fishing. Yeah, sure, but I mean, really, there's minimal options for polarized. What do you think about Carl Zeiss lenses, Zach? Oh, that's the best. You can't get better. I mean, that's the pinnacle. It is. Yeah. Would you expect Carl Zeiss lenses on $95 sunglasses? What? <laughs> Are you kidding me? What do you think? Wow. Enemies and uh, these are really comfortable. They yeah. are comfortable. Yeah, I really like they these. They look good too. Those are Garrett Light. Garrett Light? Yeah. These are nice. These feel good. These feel really oh, nice. Sick line. How yeah. much? Those are 450. That's good. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. So I've got expensive taste. There's a brand that I absolutely love, uh, Retro Specs, that I've bought how many pairs? Four pairs. I've bought like four yeah. pairs of Retro Specs, but. The thing is, I love sunglasses. I also have, ex I apparently have expensive taste, but there's a difference. When you put on a pair of high-end sunglasses, like the lenses are clear, the material just feels better, and they yeah, fit better. You can feel it. These are horse and bows. It's not a horse and boost, it's horse and bows. Horse and bows. These are absolutely insane. Uh -huh. Yeah, try it on. What do you think? Stunners? <laughs> exactly. And again, again, those aren't polarized, but look at the tint in there. Look at the tint. Super cool. Yeah. Um, how much? Those are twelve hundred. Twelve hundred dollars. All right, Zach. So you sell. Yeah, please be careful with those. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So these glasses, gentlemen, right here. Please, man. Please. Five thousand dollars. What? Why? Yeah. What? Tell me about these things. So yeah. So this is actually, um, it's gold plated. Five thousand dollars. These things cost five thousand. The nose pads are gold plated too. Yeah. Everything about yeah. these glasses, gold plated. Yeah. They are by who? Retrospects and Company. Retrospects, one of my favorite brands, but damn, $5,000? I mean, Aaron, you could get those if you want. I, I could get those? I okay, what about that. what about these? What about these? These are pretty, pretty those sweet. Those are sick. That's Matsuda. Matsuda, yeah. how much are these? Those are $1,500. $1,500. And these are actually the glasses that were famous from Terminator 2. Linda Hamilton wore these in the movie Terminator 2. Terminator 2. And they, they brought them back because they were fifteen hundred dollars. So cool. It's all about the side shield that's on there. The side shield? That's yeah. worth that's worth fifteen hundred dollars? Well it's titanium, it's sterling silver, you know, there's a lot going on. Ready? Oh <laughs> what the hell? What are these? Those are by T. Henry. T. Henry. Yeah, and that this actually has if you try it on, uh, there's a clip that comes off. That's actually made of uh, 14 karat gold. 14 karat gold. How much? Yeah, those are 750. 750 bucks. That's a reasonable deal here. What? What do you think, guys? Gentlemen, so while we're here, um, Zach, you are the inspiration, and your store is the inspiration for Enemy, my sunglass line. And so while I was in Chicago, I wanted to get Zach's opinion on my glasses, but I also wanted to talk a little bit about, as somebody who sells like super premium, like top of the line sunglasses, what are some things that make sunglasses valuable or worth the money? How long have you been in the sunglass industry? Uh, 20 years. 20 years, how'd yeah. you get started? Uh, I was basically born into it. Yeah. All right. So uh, my dad started the business about uh, 50 years ago, and then uh, I kind of started out in the lab learning about lenses, and then slowly worked my way on the retail floor, slowly started to manage, and then eventually took over. So you are an expert when it comes to sunglasses and glasses. I would say, yes, I'm close to an expert. Tell everybody sort of what makes a premium sunglass a premium sunglass, as opposed to like a cheap one that you find. Yeah, you for know. sure. So um, like 
what you want to look for with a premium sunglass is like a super lightweight temple uh, that actually goes around your ear. Uh, you want your nose bridge to fit it correctly. You know what's crazy to me? Once I started getting into sunglasses with Enemy, I started noticing how sunglasses are fitting people's yeah. faces. And it is amazing how yeah. many people are wearing the wrong size sunglasses. Totally. On that point, I just want to also say, for you guys out there that have checked out Enemy and you have a bigger noggin, the good news is that we are in development for um, an XL size in the Enemy 1s and Enemy 2s, so look out for those. But let's talk about the lenses. Yeah. Okay, so premium lenses. What is the difference between a premium lens and just like a, a and yeah, so like, regular lens? So like a premium lens, it's going to have like a backside anti-reflective coating, which will reduce glare. Uh, it will make it will sharpen everything up a little bit. Uh, a non-premium lens is just going to be a very simple tint without any U V A B and C, and it's not really going to help you. What do you think of Carl Zeiss lenses? I think they're absolutely phenomenal. I think they're number one. So Zach. I want to show right. you. Yes. I want. I want to show you right. enemy. Okay. All right. Okay. Show me. All right. Enemy. So this is the line. We've got three different styles. We got enemy ones. We got enemy twos. Enemy threes. Here is the enemy one. Go. Go up and show everybody. Yeah. What do you think? These are very cool. What do you think? These are very cool. The style. It feels so light. Yeah. It's incredibly lightweight. It is. Um, and the lenses are really, really nice, dark, dark lenses, which are great for the sun. Um, I also see that they have spring hinges. They do. Which I mentioned, which I love. Which yeah. means you can take it off with one hand. The proportion. What do you think of the styling of those? I think it's awesome. My eyes are completely centered. Uh, there's a little space out here. I think, I think it's great. Nailed it. Try these. I think you killed it. Can't believe this. <laughs> Yeah, so this is really, really comfortable with the nose pads. Yeah. Um, and again, you have those spring hinges. And I love the color. I yeah. actually really like these for myself. That is the Enemy 2 in Tortoise, and then this is the Enemy 3, which is like our version of the Aviator. Oh, this is the best. You like them? This is my favorite. They're cool, Can right? you help me out with these? <laughs> These are awesome. $95. Are you kidding me? No. What do you think? Oh In terms God. of value, I think it's, I, I'm blown. I'm shocked. Legit shocked. Seriously? Seriously. That's awesome. Wow. So these were inspired by you, my friend. And so I just wanted to come by and, and check it out and have you see them and see what we came up with. I think you killed it. Killed it? Thanks, brother. If you are ever in Chicago and you're looking to come and check out some incredibly premium brands, they also have other affordable brands, you're going to carry enemies. Totally. Gonna yeah. carry enemies, guys. Yeah. You gotta come and check out my boy Zach. Glasses Limited. He's got three locations to serve you. You got one on East Oak Street where the inspiration for Enemy came from. You also have where we are right now, which is some like super high end mall. 900 North Michigan. 900 North Michigan, and you've got. Uh, Saganash Family Eye Center, which is a different. Place. It's a, it's a yeah. more family friendly place. Right. Here it's all about sexy glasses. Zach, you rock. Thank you, brother. Gentlemen, link below, enemy.com if you want to grab some super premium glasses that aren't going to break the bank like these. <laughs> Gentlemen, hit that link down below and go check out Enemy.